Julia Montesano. Round one continued with some great footy across the EDFL over the weekend. Our feature match was between Aberfeldy and Pasco Vale. Here are the highlights. So one and a half minutes gone, no score yet as, well, a quick shot at goal for Pasco Vale comes from Paddy Vespremi for Velasaris over the top, but still able to work it inside 50 Aberfeldy. Now Jaden Foster, the kicks in up and under. Remus is in the square. It might overtake him. It goes through for a goal. Dropped the chest mark, was able to recover okay. Just sent a little bit of a wobble towards half forward. Watson snap on the left. 60 metre kick ins long and oh, oh Zach Hislops turned it over straight to Ben Ross and now they've got numbers running the other way. Pasco Val Sonchin is able to give it off to Vez Premi. Vez Premi can run to 55 and kick up beauty. Maybe Pasco Val can work it through hands now, but Sonchin, he's in trouble. He's oh. holding the ball. Has to be. The crowd likes that and I think it's Blackwell. The Panthers, although Aberfeldy plays stayed down, gave it off and now running through is Valisaris. Has to stop, prop, give the handball off and get it back. Go the old one, two, dish the ball off. Inside 50, have a shot on goal. And Aberfeldy, they're back in this game. They draw level after trailing by five goals. And they have it in a dangerous position once again and perhaps they can take the lead here. As it's a bit of a mad scramble at ground level. Quick shot at goal comes and it's through. If he can trap it before the boundary line, he does, he takes a bounce. He runs to 50, he's in front of the hill. Do something special, no, gives the handball off. There's three Aberfeldy players, and they're gonna kick another one. That is huge play there by Aberfeldy. And Nick, Cat uh, sorry, Sam Catapan, he kicks his first for the afternoon. Has time, handball over the top to Guess. Now he can get it inside 50. Where's Petroni, where's Watson? Well, Foster's there, so is Petroni. He's come down with it. <laughs> he's taken out one-handed. <laughs> In this third quarter, they desperately need a goal. Pasco Vale, as Petroni comes in, he starts it out to the right and brings it back. And Pasco Vale aren't finished yet. So Inglis comes in, he'll kick from about 50 metres out, pretty much directly in front. The goal umpire doesn't move. And Pasco Vale retakes the lead. Gave it up to Ross. Quick kick came in for Pasco Vale. Watson sets himself, may have been held onto. Umpire said no. Polizzi was smothered, running into it. Hanson! <laughs> There it is, he gets go. one. <laughs> Lockie Hansen gets into the game and he gets Pasco Vale in front. Finds Cassanides, goes out wide. Luke Foster was cut off by Jaden Foster. And now Aberfeldy, they've caused the turnover. Nick Catapan goes in, pound, one on one. This time, oh, takes a chest mark, gives the handball off. And Madden, he runs into an open goal. And Aberfeldy, there, back in front. Worked his way through some traffic, and the kick was pretty good for Peters. Getting across was Foster. Good defensive effort. Peters did okay. Oh, oh, right. How about the big Ruckman tearing him down? He did pretty well there, Giles Guest. Foster able to get a kick away. It was touched, so Ross had to get moving, and he did to Inglis. Pasco Vale holding on here. They're doing it well. Wait too long. Goes oh. in short. Oh. Take the mark. Ball spills out. Aberfeldy, they've got a few numbers. They center it up. Pounds there. Oh. Umpire says play on, touched off the boot, and then the quick kick came out. So Pasco Vale, they're just launching. Cubillo couldn't take it. Berry, he sh takes it, and then Sam Catapan takes the mark. Not going to get the 50. Next goal win, boys. Next goal Gives win. it off. Remus, can he be the hero for Aberfeldy? Yes, he can! And Kyle, he kicks it from 45, and Aberfeldy, they hit the lead by two points. From the stoppage, Boyd thumped it out. He had a teammate there. If he can just handle it, Inglis, he couldn't. He was tackled. He was taken high. Last nice chance here for Paco. The locals aren't happy about it. It's Michael Ross. He's got to get it moving quickly. He's in the middle of the ground. He just sends it long towards half forward. Who's there? Who can take a mark at the back? No mark taken. The snap comes from Sonchin. Bouncing. Bouncing. Goal! Dean Sonchin, you superstar. And Pasco Vale back in front. Got to move it quickly now. There can't be long left. We've ticked over into 30 minutes. Handball, Aberfeldy will go forward. They'll go inside 50 through Nick Catapan. He's got a huge foot, a one-on-one. Pound, and make that a two-on-one. He's down. Oh. Aberfeldy have the numbers. The man the goal square. Sam Catapan, he will run in and put Abers back in front. But the ball is heading in the wrong direction for the Panthers. Hiding him, able to pick it up. He's been great all day. Got He's got a man out wide. It's Michael Ross. He can get it and go. He does. He sends it long once again. He's got a man in a one-on-one. -on -one. Can he mark it? Oh, big fly oh. to the back. No mark. Oh, oh Watson almost just able to it. handle it at ground level. He just couldn't hold on. And the ball over the boundary line. No, no free, free kick. It's, it's Craven. 
Big play here. Boyd comes in. Foster to do the ruck work for Aberfeldy. Won it down. Paco have the numbers. Aberfeldy get it out in the quick kick, but it's all Pasco Vale. Go, go. Hardingham plays on immediately. Swings on to his right. Sends a long ball. Yes, There's the siren. siren. And Aberfeldy win an absolute thriller at Clifton Park. So it was a great win for Aberfeldy, and Jacob Craven was our raw form seamless compression player of the day. We've got a big event coming up on Friday night where Jakarta will take on West Meadows. You can watch that on the EDFL's Facebook page live from 7pm. Our EDFL match of the day on Saturday is Strathmore taking on Greenvale. Enjoy your weekend.